Hello everyone. I wanted to go over an interesting feature on the iPhone SE. Let's get to where I'm trying to get at. I want to make sure I'm in the right settings. It doesn't show my name so no one doxes me. Doxes me. Battery percentage. So, this is an interesting feature that are on iPhones ever since when I worked at a third party repair shop. Not a third, well, it was a third party when Apple, it was back when the iPhone scare back in like 2018 when they were like, oh, the, you're slowing batteries down, which it's up for debate, but I will say with my experience, like other phones, Apple just does not like to make a perfect phone. The iPhone X was a perfect phone. What happened? They got rid of it. Now it's like the iPhone XS Max, blah, 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 blah. The iPhone X is a great phone. In my personal experience, I will say Apple saw the iPhone X and they were like, oh, this phone is too perfect. We got to get rid of a camera. We got to complicate. XR is the new one because... We just made too good of a phone. That's how I say it. Maybe I'm right. Maybe I'm wrong. Anyway, after they were caught slowing down batteries, which in inadvertently made the phone run slower, they made an application, which cut my hours to the third-party job because they're like, oh, Apple figured it out because we're the greatest people in the world. So... Here is an application. This is basically the application. You got battery percentage, which I think has always been there. I always keep it on. Because I like numbers. I don't want to see a random bar. I want to see 41%. All right, that makes much more sense than a random black bar, which will turn red, orange, blah, 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 blah. Low power mode I have in low power mode I have not gambled too much with, but from what I can see, the low power mode temporarily reduces background activity like downloads and mail fetch until you can fully charge your phone. In my honest opinion, Apple does have a very good strong side with managing battery life. So you don't necessarily need that. I mean if you're gaming or you're just using it all day maybe that would work for you when you can't charge it but what i want to show you is battery health now i want to like document this okay 100 percent battery life yeah 100 percent most iphones i work on as a technician you'll see like 80 90 once you start getting under 80 you're either going to want to buy like a $15 Mofi case on Amazon or a new battery change, which varies, and that's your call. But, I, I mean, I would try and start off the Mofi case if you want. The Mofi case charges your phone. It connects like a case. And um, I had one before. They were good. I would recommend them. So I kind of want to just go over that. Just want to give an example. This is a one week old iPhone SE 2020 version and the battery capacity is at 100%. Now I will be documenting this throughout the year because I really am curious how this 100% stays. Does it stay 100%? We're gonna find out, all right? If you guys have any questions about Apple batteries, and such feel free to post it in the comments i am going to use my off-brand thingy to spin it around a bit i'm going to look at my iFixit toolkit and play with the bits a little bit and do random stuff and try and find something to fix but for right now that's all i can really get to tonight have a great night guys i hope you enjoyed my hands in my Samsung Gear S3, which has gone through hell and high water, and it's still alive. Yeah, you're still alive, buddy. Have a great week, everyone. Namaste.